Hello friends, in this video tutorial, we will learn, how admin can view single user complete details in pop-up bootstrap modal on web page, from the list of register user data. In previous, part we have already seen, how to load register user data in jQuery data table, at admin side by using PHP script with Ajax. Now for view single user data, first we want to make view details button, for this we have go ajax action.php file, and go to block of user page code. And here in dollar sub array is equal to blank value, we have write button type is equal to button, name is equal to view details, and class is equal to details. Here we have add id attribute is equal to dollar row user id variable and in button text we have write view details here we will user class as selector in jquery code and id variable we will use for fetch complete user data friends here we can view register user data in tabular format so we have refresh web page, after refresh of page, here we can view button has appear. By click on this button, bootstrap modal will pop up on web page, with particular user data. For this things, we have go to user.php file, and here we can view bootstrap modal skeleton html code. Here first, we add id attribute is equal to details modal. After this, we have go to modal title class, and here we write user details, this is header of this modal. Now we have go to modal body class, and here we have write id attribute is equal to user details, under this tag, we will display particular user details. So here our HTML code is ready, now we have go to jQuery code part, and here we have write dollar with document selector, with on method. And under this we have write click event, with button class details. So when user has click on view details button, then this block of code will execute. Under this block, we have write user id variable is equal to dollar this with attribute method, and under this we have write id, it will fetch button id attribute value, and store under this user id variable. Now we have star write ajax request, so in first option, we have write url set to ajax action.php file, it will send request to this file. In second option, we have write method, and here we can define form data submit method, so here we have use post method for send data to server. In third option, we have write data, and here we can define which data we want send to server, so here we have define action variable, with value fetch data, user id variable value, and page variable with value user. In Ajax request, in last option, we have write success callback function, this function will be execute, if ajax request completed successfully, and it will receive data from server. Under this function, we have write dollar with division tag id user details, with html method, 
and under this we have write data variable, it will display user details under this tag. Below this, we have write dollar with modal id detail modal, with modal method, and this we have write show, this method will pop up bootstrap modal on web page. Now we have go to ajax action.php file, and here we have go to this page is equal to user block of code. Under this block, we have write dollar post action variable value is equal to fetch data, if this condition true, then it will execute if block of code. Under this block, we have write dollar exam object, with query variable is equal to, select star from user table, where user id is equal to, dollar post user id variable, this query will fetch single user data from user table. Below this query, we have write dollar result variable is equal to, dollar exam object, with query result method, this method will execute above query, and return query execution result. For fetch data from dollar result variable, we have write for each loop, and under condition we have write dollar result variable, as dollar row variable. Under this loop, First we have write dollar is email verified variable is equal to blank value. After this, we have write if statement, and under condition, we have write dollar row user email verified variable value is equal to yes, if this condition true, then it will execute if block of code. And under this block, we have write dollar is email verified variable is equal to label tag with class is equal to badge and badge success with text like email verified. But suppose above condition false, then it will execute else block of code, and here we have write dollar is email verified variable is equal to label tag with class is equal to badge and badge success, with text email not verified. After this, we have write, dollar output variable, and in this variable we have append HTML code. First, we want to display user profile image, so here we have write image tag, with source is equal to upload folder slash dollar row user image variable it will display user profile email after this we have want to display user name so here we have write dollar row user name variable for display user gender details here we have write dollar row user gender variable. For display user address detail, here we have write dollar row user address variable. After this, for display user mobile number details, here we have write dollar row user mobile number variable. After this, for display user email address details, here we have write dollar row user email address variable. And for display user email status detail, here we have write dollar is email verified variable, it will display user email status details. So, this way we have store user details in HTML format, in this dollar $output variable, now we want send to Ajax request, 
so here we have write dollar echo statement with dollar output variable so here our code is ready to view single user details in modal so we have check output in browser friends first we have refresh web page after refresh of page here we can see register user list in jQuery data table. Here we can see view button in each row of data. So first we have click on this user view details button. After click on view details button, here we can see bootstrap modal has been pop up on web page and under this we can see user complete details with profile image by click on view button we can see any user complete details in pop-up modal so this way we can load dynamic data in bootstrap modal by using PHP script with Ajax in next part we will start making online exam by load question details so when exam has been started user can view exam. If you have some suggestion regarding this PHP based online examination system, you can comment in comment box. If you want to learn this system, please stay connected with us.